All right, let's talk about when you take the batteries apart the way that I do. Sometimes the wrappers will peel off of it when you do a little bit, you'll get a little crack. And otherwise, you wind up with this. And if you notice, all three of these are about the same basic style of the lithium ion battery here. And you notice there's three different colors. The glue that they glued them inside these was so strong that when you tried to remove the cells, the wrap peeled right off with it. <coughs> so you're left with these cells that you have to peel the rest of the wrapper off of it. And you wind up with these bare naked cells that you got here. And you've got to rewrap them. Now, the dangerous part of an 18650 is right there between this part of the positive and this part of the negative. There's just a little tiny ring that's inside there that prevents them from touching each other and shorting out. Don't need that anymore. The rest of the cells are good. But what you need are some protective rings and you can buy these off eBay or a company called Fast Tech. I had good reliability from them and you put that ring around there. You cannot use notebook hole reinforcements. They do not fit. So you have to buy these special rings with the adhesive and put them on there on all the ones that don't have it to start off with. And that will protect them from shorting out by something dropping across between the positive and the negative, which would be very easy to do if you didn't have that on there. So that's your first line of protection. All these ones that don't have that protective ring. And the last one. After that, we need to rewrap these cells. And that's what all these colored, looks like just little pieces of them, but they're actually shrink wrap. You're going to need your heat gun for this phase of the operation. And first you have to put the wrap on, then you have to put the gloves on, then you have to use the heat gun 